I'll tell you something else has got me very excited. You all know SpaceX, the rocket and design and manufacturing company started by Tesla founder Elon Musk, okay? Today, they did a test launch of their biggest rocket yet, the Falcon Heavy. Check it out. And that was just the beginning. The Falcon Heavy's boosters disengaged and had to land safely on landing pads with pinpoint accuracy. Check that out. And the Falcons have landed. The Falcons have landed. <laughs> the Falcons. Land. The Falcons have land. landed. Screw the Eagles. The Falcons win the Super Bowl. <laughs> Give them the trophy. <laughs> but here's the kicker. This is the really, this is the really exciting part. The launch was to demonstrate that the Falcon was not only reusable, but the Falcon Heavy can carry a large payload. So to test it, Elon Musk sent up his own Tesla convertible with a dummy astronaut at the wheel, blasting David Bowie's life on Mars. <laughs> That's right. This is absolutely true. A giant phallus cranking rock and roll, releasing a red convertible into the dark void. And the award for most midlife crisis goes to Elon Musk. Ah. And So what we saw just there, what we saw just there of the car, that was an animation, but here's an actual live stream right now from the car as it heads out into outer space, and on the touchscreen it says, don't panic. <laughs> Which, as we all know, is a reference to Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. We get it, Musk. You're king nerd. <laughs> I relinquish my crown. <laughs> Here. Come claim it. Come claim it, Galactus. So now Falcon will orbit the sun before heading to Mars, where Musk says the Tesla will be in deep space for a billion years or so in Mars orbit. No surprise. I mean, you got to circle Mars forever to find parking. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, in the other frontiers of science, snack food, yesterday, uh, news exploded online that Pepsi's CEO, Indra Nuri, hinted on a podcast that Doritos is making lady-friendly chips that don't crunch for women. <laughs> Not only that, but if it does make noise, it will be immediately interrupted by a crunching male chip. <laughs> now, oh, if you're wondering, oh. if you're wondering, as I am, why, God, why, it turns out that PepsiCo, who owns Doritos, claims that research has found women do not like to crunch loudly or lick their fingers when eating in front of others. What kind of disgusting focus group was that? <laughs> hey, lady, lick your fingers. Did you like that? Did you like me watching you? <laughs> this is for science, by the way. No, 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 no. I stay behind the mirror. Only I get to see. <laughs> now, the lady chips would be palatable uh, for women in other ways, too. They'll even come in special packs specifically designed to fit in women's handbags. I don't know if women need help fitting food in their handbags. <laughs> if you've ever been to a buffet with my Aunt Noreen, she'll roll up with a clutch purse and leave with enough shrimp for a month. <laughs> we'll be right back.